The Undertaker is widely regarded as one of the most famous wrestlers in WWE history, a future Hall of Famer and one of the best big men the company has ever had. Undertaker has gone through various gimmicks and nicknames over the years and has been a consistent main eventer since the early 90s. Despite this, his appearances in recent times have largely been disappointing due to the dead man's age and injuries finally catching up with him. Many expected him to retire after his WrestleMania match with Roman Reigns, though he has still yet to hang up his boots, wrestling at WWE's controversial Saudi Arabia show against Bill Goldberg and recently teaming up with Roman Reigns at Extreme Rules. Earlier this spring, Undertaker surprised both fans and WWE officials by announcing he would be appearing at the StarCast event and also agreeing to a Q&A tour of the United Kingdom before Vince McMahon had to step in with a new contract for the Phenom, preventing him from going to any other company or appearing on tours. Details were originally scarce on Taker's new contract, but now Dave Meltzer from the Wrestling Observer has revealed that the contract is in fact a lifetime deal. McMahon, afraid he would lose one of his most famous stars, apparently gave him the new contract for more money in order to make sure The Undertaker will be locked into the WWE for good even after his wrestling career is over. Undertaker's possible match with Drew McIntyre at SummerSlam is still yet to be officially confirmed by the WWE, but it seems we will still be seeing plenty more of The Undertaker in the coming years, whether that be on screen or in a backstage role. This is Wrestling Rambles, signing off.